All right, what's up everybody? It's Lithium Gaming, and today I'm gonna to show you how to install Project M Pat Edition on a hackless Wii. The first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is download the files off uh, his blog post. It's, uh, yeah, it's through Mediafire. It's a really user-friendly download, so it won't be too hard to access and get. All right, the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do after you download all of your files is you're gonna to wanna to format your SD card in FAT32 format. If you don't format the SD card, the mod's just not gonna load. All right, uh, second thing you're gonna wanna do is, step I already did, you're gonna wanna drag all of the files from Project M, Pat Edition folder, which you just downloaded off the website. You're gonna drag them all these files into the root of your SD card. And then after those files are done copying, you're pretty much done on the computer. You're gonna wanna eject your SD card and you're going to move over to the Wii. All right, now that we're on the Wii, what you're gonna wanna do is just boot up Super Smash Brothers for all of you normally would. All the codes are gonna run once you go into Stage Builder. Oh, it's important to note that you can't have any custom stages on your Wii. Other than the codes won't load, it just won't work, nothing will happen. So make sure to delete all of your custom stages before you even try this. Try this method. Okay, so it's really simple. All you're gonna wanna do is go into Vault and then just click on Stage Builder. And then the code should run. And then after the code's run, Gecko should start up. And all you have to do is click Launch Game. And then it'll do the rest for you. And the game should just boot up. There you have it, guys. Project Empath Edition. It's really, really simple to install. Choose your characters. It's like a match or something. Like always, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, like, and subscribe. And if you guys want to see any other tutorials for any other any other mods around the channel like Pixar's Brawl EX or any of the other packs we have, just leave in the comments section, I'll get on it. Tutorials are really easy to make. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks again. Bye.
there is Ganondorf. like and subscribe and if you guys want to see any other tutorials for any other any other mods on the channel like pixar's brawl ex or any of the other packs we have just leave in the comments section i'll get on it tutorials are really easy to make so i hope you guys enjoyed thanks again bye Alright, what's up everybody? It's Lidisium Gaming, and today I'm going to show you how to install Project M Pat Edition on a hackless Wii. The first thing you're going to want to do is download the files off uh, his blog post. It's uh, yeah, it's through Mediafire. It's a really user-friendly download, so it won't be too hard to access and get. Alright, the first thing you're going to want to do after you download all of your files is you're going to want to format your SD card in FAT32 format. If you don't format the SD card, the mod's just not going to load. Alright, uh, second thing you're going to want to do is, step I already did, you're going to want to drag all the files from Project M, Pat Edition folder, which you just downloaded off the website. You're going to drag them all these files into the root of your SD card. And then after those files are done copying, you're pretty much done on the computer. You're going to want to eject your SD card. and you're going to move over to the Wii. And then it will do the rest for you. And the game should just boot up. There you have it guys, Project Empat Edition. It's really, really simple to install. Choose your card Slay! Fox! Sonic! Yeah, I don't know, I'll give you guys like a match or something. Like always, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate. Alright, now that we're on the Wii, what you're gonna wanna do is just boot up Super Smash Brothers for all of you know. All 
all the codes are gonna run once you go into stage builder oh it's important to note that you can't have any custom stages on your Wii other than the codes won't load it just won't work nothing will happen so make sure to delete all of your custom stages before you even try this try this method Okay, so it's really simple. All you're gonna want to do is go into Vault and then just click on Stage Builder, and then the code should run. And then after the codes run, Gecko should start up. And all you have to do is click Launch Game, 